today we're gonna be doing the ultimate modded boss challenge. I'm gonna be going up against eight different modded bosses. One at round 40, 60, 80, 100, and at round 120, we're gonna be fighting every single one of the bosses at the same time. It's going to be insane. Not only that, we have some brand new fourth path towers that are gonna help us out, like the bomb shooter sniper. This is going to be epic. Huge shout out to Lynx for the fourth path mod, as well as Warper's on for the boss pack. Let's do this. The first boss appears on round 40. So let's just, we're gonna need so many banana farms. 36 rounds before we're gonna have to start dealing with this boss. We're already leaking lives. Okay, we're gonna need open. That'll be a good spot for him. That way he can get some cleanup action. I feel like I wanna get the fourth path bomb shooter. So incendiary ordinance, bombs now set balloons on fire, ceramic buster, plasma bombs. That's so cool. Supernova. That seems like it would annihilate boss balloons. And I wanna get that. Wait, isn't there one for the sniper monkey too? A balloon zooka? Yo! Okay, I the big bang. World destroying power in a single rifle. Okay, I kind of want to get that. That seems so hype to get that for that. I'm on board. Of course, we need to make sure that we have a strong enough setup. I'm I think we'll be able to deal with most of the bosses all the way up to around a hundred. But once we get to around 120 and we have to deal with every single boss at once. I, that's what I'm worried about. I don't know if we're going to be able to actually beat that. I don't know if it's possible or not because you can set it yourself. So I decided which bosses are going to show up. And I was like, you know what? Let's just have all the bosses come at the very end. I'm sure that'll be, you know, that'll be something. So I have no idea. There's five new bosses that have been added. So I previously did a video on this and we covered it. But there's been new bosses that have been added since the update to this mod, which is so cool. Which is so hype. So that's what I'm really looking forward to is this new update. And so I added all of the new bosses to get a look at them and be able to do that. So if you want to see more of the boss path and more challenges like this in the future, please subscribe to the channel, turn on notifications, and like the video, my friends. It means so much to me when you guys... Like, when do I stop putting down banana farms is the question, I guess, and start focusing on getting defense because we're already on round 20. Now, of course, it's only on round 40, so I don't think it's going to be, like, insane, right? Like, I don't think it's going to be, like, crazy. Let's just put down all of these and then maybe we just upgrade all of these i'm gonna give this guy oh wait we have a dart monkey has a fourth path too let's go okay L what is it balloon tonium darts darts gain the ability to pop lead balloons oh spike a pole gains increased damage and then darts can now seek out balloons okay sign me up dart gunner dart gun shoots faster and pops two layers i kind of want to get that I let's get the dart gunner look at this he's the dart gunner now and the Rifleman. Dark Gun, okay. Dark Gun now fires incredibly fast and deals more damage to ceramic balloons. And he can hit lead balloons now, which is actually pretty cool. Let's go ahead and get Marketplaces. They have increased sellback value, so that's going to be pretty nice. Can I get all of these? Is it worth it to try to get all of these into Marketplaces before we go? I think we can. And then it gives us just like a couple of rounds to just save up a little bit of money. This might be super greedy though. I think I can have five rounds to generate some money and be able to actually deal with this boss. So we might just like wipe the boss out on this one because it is only around 40. So I don't think it's going to be very too difficult. Now, all of the bosses have special effects and properties. So... It might have something that I have no idea. I didn't read in into any of it what they do. So I might just kind of get clowned on here. We got a bunch of marketplaces. That's actually so nice. All right, that gives us four rounds. So let's uh, let's start working more with this guy. So we can get Rifleman. Darts, dart guns now fire incredibly fast and deal more damage to ceramic balloons. Okay. Oh, whoa, he attacks way fast. Also, I might have cross path on, but I'm not going to be using ultimate cross path for this. I'm going to do this without using that because I feel like it might make it a little bit too easy. So plasma tank. Okay, I definitely want to get that. So let's put a village right here. Bigger radius, jungle drums, primary training, primary mentoring. Maybe we put the bomb shooter here and it's going to show up in two rounds, my friends. So incendiary ordinance, bombs now set balloons on fire. And then Ceramic Buster, bombs deal significant extra damage, ceramic and fortified. 
Lightning charge. Electrically charged bombs release small lightning effect when they explode. Plasma bombs. Bomb shooter fires unstable plasma bombs that explode violently. I feel like we just want faster reload, right? I think that's what we want. Faster and missile launcher is probably the best option here. Now, I'm gonna save up my money and just see... You. Okay, here's the first boss. Wait. What's happening? It's gaining HP? Wait, there it is! What the heck is this? It's gaining lives! I'm so confused. Do damage to it. Wait, what? What is happening? What is it? Why is it? It's like gaining HP? All right, we need to get more damage onto it. Let's get this sniper. And then our sniper, we can get the fourth path from the sniper. So focus scope. And then high powered rifle. Flat gun. Blast radius is bigger and fires sharp fragments. Shrapnel shot is increased fragment and number of fragments. And then balloon zooka. Okay, let's also get balloon zooka. It's gaining HP. What's happening? Okay, I hope we're doing enough damage to it. We're starting to do a little bit more, but maybe enough might be enough. Okay, shrapnel shot. We're literally shooting missiles out of a sniper rifle. Wait, what just happened? It, it went back down again. Wait, I am so confused. Are we going to be able to pop it? It's up to 5,000. Why is his HP going up? I am so confused right now. I am so confused. I think we might lose on it on the first try. Oh, no. We didn't do any damage to it. What is this? No way are we going to lose. No way are we going to lose to it. What was that? Okay, let's find out what happened. I looked into it, and the way that this boss actually works is the more damage you do to it, the more HP that it actually has, and that's how many lives you lose. So the way you beat the boss is literally by just doing no damage to it whatsoever and just letting it go by, and then just taking the L for that. I failed to one of the bosses already, which is not a good sign, my friends. I can't go back and refight it, but in order to beat it, I just had to sell all of my tower so maybe the next boss i'll actually be able to go up against it which it just looks like a red balloon and it says it's despectus it appears in 12 rounds wait we're making so much money all right let's get some central markets let's make some money i really like this sniper monkey by the way this sniper a hundred thousand dollars okay that's really expensive and i would love to get a monkey wall street that would be so cool do you think I could save up enough to get a Monkey Wall Street so it's in 10 rounds? 9 rounds? I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna save all the way up for a Monkey Wall Street. It's $4,000 every round. Oh, boom. Okay, we got the Monkey Wall Street. Now we just gotta start preparing and getting more of like a solid setup here. So, what do we need? What's gonna be a solid option here? I mean, you really can't go wrong with getting Dartling Gunners. Right, getting like a like a hydro rocket pod dartling gunner that's gonna be very very nice to have we have 17,000 do I just save up for an MAD I mean also let's just get a ninja monkey I eventually oh wait look ninja monkey has a fourth path side toss what is this katanas size are replaced with katanas what okay that is hype but I don't think I even want that on this fourth path ninja. We'll have to, we might do a video on him, but I don't think I wanna, I want Sticky Bomb. All right, boss shows up in two rounds, my friends. Let's get ready. Let's see who we're going up against and see what this guy's all about. I, I'm gonna get, oh, we can also get an, oh, let's get ourselves an alchemist. Look at that range of that alchemist. Beautiful placement. All right, so the boss is gonna spawn, wait. So it only has 45,000 HP. So that's not too bad. Whoa, that looks weird. It's like a... Okay. Wait. Is that 450,000? No, that's only 45,000. It doesn't have that much HP, actually. We're actually doing quite a bit of damage to it. I'm... Oh, you know what I want? I want to get a Druid. I want... Eventually, I want... Do I just get Druid of the Jungle now? I don't think I do. I don't think I get Druid of the Jungle just yet. Uh, we- Oh my gosh! What the heck just happened? Why is there a BAD here? Why is it huge? Alright, I'm getting the MAD. And we're gonna, um, we're gonna have it just be on normal. Okay, we're doing tons of damage to it now. What the heck? Why is there a giant BAD on my screen? Alright, just take it out, take it out, take it out, take it out. Okay, 
Bell. That was wild. What the heck was that? Okay, Bloontonium Expert appears in 17 rounds. It's already made $73,000. It's almost paid for itself again. We got 13 rounds until the next boss shows up. That one was wild. It just like spawned a huge BAD, which was quite strange. But I didn't see any mechanics to keep an eye out for. Oh my gosh, you know what I just realized? Is we're gonna be fighting all of the bosses at once. Which means we're gonna have to go up against that boss, that one balloon, that if you do damage to it, it's gonna, it'll just get stronger. Okay, so that means we have to have a Legend of the Night. Because I think we have to have the Legend of the Night to absorb that one boss balloon. If that even works. If not, I'm just, I think we just lose. I'm gonna consider it a win if we pop every balloon except that one balloon. <laughs> Alright, what is this guy? The Plasma Tank. Machine gun attacks, fires deadly plasma tank, periodically fires a plutonium rocket that obliterates Moab class balloons. That's actually exactly what we want. I actually am going to sell this guy, and I want to put him more in the middle, because I think that's going to be better. Like, and look at this, plasma tank, boom. Do we want quick shots? I'm going to give him quick shots and very quick shots for this cross path, actually. I think that's gonna work out much better for us. And then I'm gonna get a primary expertise. We can also get the supernova, but I'm really interested to see, I wanna see these guys in action first before we go crazy on it, right? Like before we get, before we just jump into it, let's see what this Bluntonium expert is about. He shows up in three rounds. I don't know what we're gonna have to do about this Bluntonium expert. But luckily I don't think, oh wait, this guy even has Bluntonium darts. Literally, it's maybe what if this guy is actually the counter, but he's also the boss is a Bluntonium expert So I really don't know what that means. I want spirit of the forest That's gonna just be some crazy damage there solid cleanup good boss damage Especially like right in the middle. All right next round on round 80 is gonna be the Bluntonium expert I'm a little bit scared not gonna lie so far, we're one for one. Okay, well, wait, no, we're one for two. We're one for two. We've won one and we've lost one. Not a great score, but we have, okay, what in the world? This thing is gnarly looking. We won, we just beat the ZOMG. We didn't actually beat the boss. Okay, so wait, oh my gosh. It has so much HP. He's so fast. How the- wait, wait, wait. He's regenerating HP so fast right now. All right, we need a supernova. Wait, how do you take- get rid of him from regenerating HP? Wait, what the heck? Wait, look- okay, okay, wait, 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 wait. We, let's find out why he regenerates so fast. Wait, so it just constantly regenerates almost 1% of his max health every second? What? What? That's crazy. How are you supposed to beat that? Okay, so we're back. I had to reset everything up, but we're here about to go up against round 80. Now, this boss regenerates almost 1% of his health every second. So we just have to do so much damage to it that we can actually wipe it out. So we have to figure out how to get enough damage against it. So let's give it a try. All right, so it has 450,000 HP. I really feel like Ninja Paragon's gonna be our best bet here, actually. Let's start going ahead and trying to get this Ninja Paragon set up. So we need Master Bomber. Uh, let's get a Grand Saboteur. Oh my gosh, like no damage is happening right now. We need $540,000 though. We're gonna have to do it. Oh no, it pains my soul. It hurts. It hurts. Okay, we need, we still need like $30,000. What can we sell? What can we sell in order to do this? Uh, what do we not need? Okay, that guy's doing pretty good. That's 4,000. All right, I'm selling our Sniper Monkey. I'm sorry, Sniper Monkey. Okay, Ascended Shadow. Please be enough damage. Oh my gosh, there we go. There we go. Okay, th this guy's actually crushing it. Let's go. Oh my gosh. Ninja Paragon is annihilating him. Oh my gosh. Okay. Okay, we we were able to deal with that. But now we have another boss. Oh my gosh. It's just getting out of hand now. Okay, I got to get back to farms. All right, we have a Ninja Paragon and that's great. All right, let's just, Oh my gosh. It hurts having to go back to just one banana farm. 
all of that time. Or oh, wait, wait, wait. No, 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 no. This is the play. This is the play. Hear me out. We sell the Ninja Paragon. We don't need it anymore. And we can go ahead and actually let's go and get a Banana Central. All right. And then, yeah, we're getting Banana Central. It's the only option, okay? And then we can do this and we can just make all of our money back. I actually should have gone the wrong... I went the wrong one, I think. But it's 12 rounds before to go up against this guy. Do you think I'm going to be okay? I don't know. But hopefully this is going to give us enough money. All right, if we need to, if we need to, I can sell it all and get a Ninja Paragon back down again. All right, so this guy shows up in seven rounds. Oh, man, I'm scared. All right, this guy has been really useful. The bomb shooter. Let's get the supernova bomb shooter. Let's see what that does. Oh, man, look at that go. Okay, that's been very nice. Let's go ahead and get Spirit of the Forest. We have five rounds, and we're doing pretty good. So I think these guys are doing, doing, they're doing work, okay? They're starting, they're putting in the effort, all right? They're going crazy. Five rounds before Motus. What is Motus? I don't like this. What is, it has like these five, it's like all these different directions. Oh no. Does it mean that he'll just like fly all over the place? I have no idea. Maybe I should have done research into what these, all of these bo bosses do before I went up and fight them. But that's not any fun. Oh my gosh, is that, what, how much HP is that? Is that, it's a, what is, it's like a hundred million HP. Okay, we definitely are going to need some paragons of some kind, right? Okay, sell everything, sell, 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 sell. Okay, $700,000, nice. Let's get our ninja paragon back. It's really slow though really slow and 19 rounds okay so master bomber i'm also gonna put down this guy because i think it might help us get a higher degree paragon or at least i'm gonna hope it does i don't have enough money now oh no 540,000. okay i gotta sell it what a waste of my money i feel like i've ended up not having and he's only a degree level oh no oh no am i not gonna be able to beat this guy he has so much hp we might have to do something crazy here. We might have to. We ha We might have to enable crossbat. Wait, he's flipping my towers around. That's what he's doing. He's literally like making all my towers flip around. He's got. Is that a hundred? Is that ten million HP? Wait, I think that's ten million HP. We might need to do something crazy here. I think I'm gonna have to sell this ninja monkey if we ever if we want to win and crossbat because there's no other way. What happens when he gets down to the skull? Oh no. Oh no. This isn't good. Oh no, I don't think we're gonna be able to beat this guy. I'm selling my, I'm selling the ninja monkey. This guy's crazy. What happens if I get a cross path sniper? Is that even enough to deal with it? Look at, this is a cross path sniper. It's doing nothing to him. Oh my gosh, all my towers are everywhere now. All of my towers are literally everywhere. Okay. I'm going to see if we can still maybe salvage this. What's another tower that we can that we can try to get? Uh, I, all my towers are everywhere. Do we have a permabrew? I don't think we do. Okay, let's get a berserker brew. Or a permabrew. They just keep swapping all of our towers around. No! No, it's getting out of hand. There's only one option left. We need to get super mines. Okay. Oh my gosh, we might be able to beat it. We might be able to pull this one off. Use our ability, go! Oh my gosh. This is the tankiest boss I've ever gone up against in my whole life. Oh my gosh, come on! Wait, where's the other? Oh no, he's over here. When's the ability gonna come off cooldown? I don't know if we have it or not! MAD, please, go MAD. Oh my gosh, it's down to two million HP. Use every ability you got. It's down to 100 million, it's getting close to the end, come on! Oh my gosh, everything! Holy cow, that required me using every single modded cross path in like everything and it's still these bosses are crazy. And now we have to deal with all of them in four rounds. There's
There's no way! There's no way I can deal with all of them in four rounds. I need, I have to get Legend of Darkness. That's the only way. Look at this. How does this have negative six million pops? What? <laughs> Five million pops? That's crazy. Six million. Okay. Now it's literally all of them at once. Okay. Oh no. And there's some bosses we don't even know that are. What is this guy? What is this fire magma guy? Where did all my money go? Look, my money! My money's gone! I got no money! Oh, it's over. It's over. What do I do? Oh no, the sniper! This Look at- he's just generating more HP for- Wait, 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 sniper, 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 stop. Why is the sni- Oh no, he's gonna be the first one that gets through! Oh gosh! Oh gosh, I can't use any abilities either! So, there's a boss that stopped all of my abilities. <laughs> Look at the vortex. Is that 50 million? How are you supposed to beat these guys? This is absolutely outrageous. Okay. Oh, wait, wait, no. I have to sell. I have to sell. I need a legend. I have to get Legend of the Darkness or else we just lose. I can't sell them. I can't sell them. I need Legend of the Darkness. Uh, sell, sell, sell. All right, quick. Get Legend of the Darkness. All right, Legend of Night. All right, we got Legend of the Night. Is that going to work? No, it doesn't. We still just lose. Okay, I've come to the conclusion that this is the most insane mod of all time, everybody. If you think I can actually beat this, I should try again. Let me know. But other than that, I'm out of here.